Hi everyone, Claire Maxwell here at Embodied Learning Systems. Today's video is a two-part exercise for breathing, but it's not a breathing exercise. It's a vagus nerve exercise. Now, lots of folks are getting familiar with this amazing nerve now, and you probably know that it's like 80% of your autonomic uh, nerve tissue, your autonomic nervous system is your vagus. So how can you exercise that? Well, um, that's the whole point because when we try to directly ease breathing, when we do breathing exercises, when we become more self-conscious about our breathing, we often tend to uh, just make it worse or tighter or more restricted. So this is a different way in, okay? So you're gonna to need to have an image of what this amazing nerve looks like so that you can travel along its pathway in your imagination. That's gonna be the first exercise. So take a look at this image and just let it make an impression on you. Um, you it's too much to memorize or know anything precisely, but just look at the whole uh, beauty of it. It runs from the brain stem um, about an inch inside the ear canal, all the way down both sides of your body, spreading front and back, all the way down to the bottom of your digestive tract. It's amazing, take a look. Okay, so get yourself comfortable and begin this exploration by using the tiny little bit of sensory function of this ear, this uh, nerve, the vagus nerve. It brings sensation to your ear canal. So just so you can get an idea of where it starts. I've got these annoying things in, but take a hold of your ear cartilage and just lift it up a little bit, gently. And enjoy the sensation and maybe a little bit of sound that comes when you move this ear canal. I've got these plugs in, so I hear a little bit of sound from them. And then, you know, maybe tilt your head just a little and open your jaw super gently and just see, ah, does I, can I feel that inside the skin of my ear canal? Okay, so now, if you like, you could even be lying down or just sitting back in a chair. You can close your eyes because this is a journey of the imagination. So from that deep inside the ear place, right next to the brain stem, you start to travel down your throat. I'm using touch with my fingers on the sides of my throat until I get to my voice box, which if you hum a little bit, you can feel. And just know that the vagus nerve has several little branches that embrace that whole structure and help you feel very subtle movements. Traveling down underneath your right collarbone and your left collarbone. Your vagus nerve has branches that embrace the carotid artery. And I don't know the pro the, all the names, but there's an artery on the right and an artery on the left. And it has special branches that sense pressure on the artery wall, composition, of the 
blood inside the artery. It has more branches that embrace the entire structure of your heart, front and back. There are branches that go back into your lungs and spread out, giving you very um, subtle sensations about the movement of your lungs. Traveling deeper, there's branches that embrace your stomach, branches that embrace your kidneys in the back, your liver, and all the different parts of your digestive tract. The descending colon that goes all around, and then the incredibly complex, deep front to back, um, small intestine that's like many, many turns and twists. Um, the size of, I don't know what it is, the size of a baseball field or something. And then some of the large intestine at the bottom. So at the end of this, just place your hands on your belly and gently open your jaw and enjoy the sensation of the skin inside your ear. Very delicate movement when you open your jaw and close it and the skin and the warmth of your hands on your belly. And just imagine that this nerve has its own animated energy that flows up to support your brain and receives this beautiful attention that you are giving it with your brain. So there's kind of a flow up the system and then back down the system. And I just want you to do a gentle stretch. So I'm gonna move my camera a little bit. So with your hands here on your belly, you're just gonna bow your head over and imagine this nerve folding and softening. Feeling the movement of the skin at the back body and the skin at the front body. And just check in with yourself and see, has your breathing changed? Ask the question lightly so that you don't get hung up on it. And stay tuned in two weeks, we'll have a second um, video about the vagus. There's so much to explore with the vagus, but this is your first way in. Okay, peace and love, thanks for watching. And if you'd like to subscribe to my newsletter, you'll get a little bit more detailed uh, guidance and some images and links to scientific articles and uh but on the newsletter you can't hear my cat <laughs> meowing so subscribe hit the subscribe button and i'll see you in a couple of weeks okay bye